Hello everybody and welcome back to another Cartoon Pony video and I know I have not uploaded in quite a while. I'm sorry, um, I just didn't really feel like it <laughs> and I've been doing quite a bit of stuff in, um, in other places such as downtown. No, I'm kidding. Um, that, that's not, that, that didn't work well, but we're back with Dungeon Realms and we've got a lot of fish and that thing what's going on here I don't know but I do know what I'm gonna do um excuse me here <coughs> jeez um I'm actually gonna go into the tier 2 and kind of in, uh, show you guys what it's like in Dead Peaks and the Savannah when you get into the tier 3 section. And I know you are uh, you guys are thinking probably like, oh, but dude, you just said, oh, you don't want to go risk yourself. Well, I've actually already tried this solo and it went pretty well for me. Like, I just had a little strategy, but hopefully I don't die. If I do, we'll be fine. All my good stuff is here. And I got a new sword, as well as that one. Um, so yeah, off and away we go, question marks. <laughs> um, but I also joined a faction, Kill. Um, so if you ever see me online, just message me if you want to join. There's also other people um, in my guild, and you see the people who are there there's members that you can ask them uh if you can be invited i have no idea how to invite because i'm because i'm really newbie but yeah um i lost all my gem sacks while i was uh farming well, obviously that sounds a little weird but it's okay when it sounds weird it's good because if there was nothing that was weird in the world everything would look the same but I don't know what life is about. So, yeah, I'm not sure if I uploaded the Dungeon Realms video where I showed you a whole bunch of farming spots. But if I did, then you guys might remember this spot. But there's already a guy here. So I'm going to be unhappy face and go somewhere else. But I also found a Tier 1 boss elite. <laughs> except they're really easy. Um... Uh, where are they? Okay, so they're in there. They're so they're guarded by tier two. Um, it's a witch, Agatha. And see, I can easily destroy her with my sword because she just kind of ran up to me. She has like zero health. <laughs> so yeah, it's kind of like a tier one boss where you're supposed to be tier one. And have like five damage per hit, and then it'll take like ten hits to kill them. But I do somewhere around like forty to fifty damage per hit, and I can crit. So yeah, and see, I'm not even worrying about taking damage here because my stuff, whatever it's called, my armor, is so good. I also got a really OP uh, bow, and it's got quite a bit of damage let's see yeah I, okay never mind <laughs> i was lying i don't do like 50 damage i do like 40 <laughs> 10 damage difference big difference especially when i'm trying to get tier 4 stuff but i've got pretty good tier 3 but it's not the best like i've seen tier 3 that does more than like medium tier 4 like, so, I I was just thinking, like, oh, this tier 3 is not really that good. And then I saw some of the swords that were for sale. Uh, this tier 3 that I've got right now is about, maybe, it's got about 10 points of damage on all the others. And it has about, how many diff how many more abilities? <laughs> like, 7? <seven? laughs> um, 7 ability upgrades than the others? So, that's... A big difference to me. Gems. Hey guys, smack, smack. And see if I get too low on health, which most likely I won't. I'll just back up and funnel them. But right now, it 
it's not much of a worry to me because I can just kind of tank damage. Just have to be careful with my stamina though, because sometimes I run out of stamina, and then I um, and then I end up having to back out. Oh, hey there, buddy. Headshot. Oh, headshot. By the way, headshots do crit, uh, just like in Minecraft normally. Um, uh, what am I gonna drop? Let's drop a potato. Eh, that's a mess sword. One time, I'm not sure if I showed a video, but I found a really OP bow, just like this one that I'm finding. For some reason, I'm not super excited, like, yelling, like, oh my gosh, it's so cool. Like, but that bow is better than the bow that I have right now, because, like, sometimes I just find really OP bows in these chests. Oh, hey, you lazy bandit, die. Hehe, <laughs> I'm not evil. I don't need that, but here's like the first step towards the tier 3 guys at the end. And essentially dead peaks, but when I went into dead peaks, I almost died. And man, I was so like, I was just like, if I lose this armor, I will go berserk. And I will like, quit. Oh yeah, I also found a chest plate that's unique or rare. And it gives you, I think, uh, tier 2 chest plate, by the way. I think it gives you 340 health. I'll have to go to my e-chest bank thingy, whatever it's called. I just call it the e-chest. But here's the next step. And obviously someone just went and looted it. But there's also a T2 elite in there, which is pretty fun to fight. Although he's pretty easy to beat for me because because of my stuff but he's got more health than the normal t2s but it looks like the guy totally raided everything and you can't open the chests um when there's guys underneath you though so that's another thing there's also a hidden chest behind the tents here right here so that's why you sometimes see guys up there because there's uh there's been players who have just went over there and then the Enemies have been drawn to them. Hehe. <laughs> um, but... Yeah, and so the T2 Elite spawns down here. Um, it, he's kind of got this weird throne. It's like... It, it's like a mini dungeon that takes five seconds. Okay. T2 chest plate. And a health pot that I don't need. Because I don't use health pots. Because I have too many fish. For a second I thought this was a T3 chest plate. Um how much health does that give? Yeah. Like I just bring the T2 chest plates just back with me if because like I just turn them into scraps for my T3 stuff. But sometimes I just spend gems on repairing it. I don't know if I can just like walk by these guys and walk up to them in their face and just be like, hey, guess what? Bam. Ooh, that looked like it hurt. Yeah, that does more damage than mine, but this one has fire damage. So does this. So, those two together. Like, if the last weapon that you equipped was your fire damage one, and then you had another fire damage one, then it would still keep the fire damage. Sometimes it doesn't update that, but like, I wish it would just look at the stuff in your hotbar and your armor, and then it would say like, oh, well, if he's got one that does... Blah 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 plus fire damage. Then why, uh, why does he not get it? Let me give it to him and stuff. And merchant, jeez, I'm already filling up. Okay, is that T two? Yeah, yes. Okay, I'm gonna repair this. And I can use it. Yay! So here we go, we're getting into the T3-ish area. It's mainly just T2, but it looks like this guy has basically cleared out the front for me. So, thanks, but your help is no longer needed. I wish this was a chaotic zone so I could exterminate him. Like a Dalek. I don't watch Doctor Who, by the way. Just saying. Saying random stuff. do 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 Ooh, power up. Damage buff. Dun, 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 dun. I want to fight the teeth. 
Eh. Fight. See, it's not that hard. <laughs> Although, sometimes they have a little bit more health than my gems. And only 12 of them. He's trying to team with me. Sure. I'll team with you. Team. Team, bro. Yeah, yeah, team. Can I just wa want to, like, walk into that fire? But fire does the same amount of damage, by the way. Like, if you just walk through it. It's a bug that they should fix. You see all those chests over there? I wish they weren't locked. And, um, there's a balcony up on the upstairs over there. Uh, don't go on it. It has absolutely nothing. And then, yeah. I want to kind of try this on, um, one of their faces. Alright, so, but there is enemies up here, so. Okay, you do a lot of damage, my friend. Ducking in my bow. Ooh, an orb of peace. I have like 20 orbs of peace. Like, I found that they're not that much money. Like, I didn't know that. Why didn't I know that? Because I had a shop, and I sold like 20 of them for one, do one, uh, one gold, and like, I don't, they went out in like the first five minutes that I put them up for sold, uh, for sale. Like, so I was figuring like, oh, they must be worth more. So I put them up for 10. No one bought them. <laughs> um, and then my shop ended before the, before, who's he, what's it? Don't do that phone. Don't do that. Don't like you. Battle staff. I have a better staff. Eh. Pew. Shooting you with my sword. Eh. Yeah. Well, that's kind of it, but there's like that one T2 guy, so. I'm gonna end the video here, guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye.